Let's talk about hive minds. And no, I'm not talking about alien creatures that may exist in a galaxy far, far away. Bees and ants. In particular today about bees. Bees exhibit fascinating behavior where they essentially act both collectively and individually. The importance of this is absolutely staggering because it can teach us a lot about ourselves. In particular, things like our neurobiology. So our neurons in our brains do similar things where collectively they are capable of enormous tasks. However, individually, they are fairly replaceable and uh, not overly potent. So something fascinating bees can do when they are searching for a new hive is to go out and basically census for data. They will go and over a period of days survey many, many different sites and vote. Then on subsequent days, more and more of these scout bees will go out and investigate these sites. What's really fascinating is they will also respond to things like weather events. For instance, one particular site might be getting multiple votes on nice weather days. However, as the weather turns inclement and suddenly it rains, the bees might realize that this is no longer a good nesting site and completely abandon it from their search. So eventually what happens is they will coalesce on a particular site and then on a particular day, the entire swarm or a large portion of it in unison will leave and go to that site to start building a nest. To me, this is fascinating. And it's even inspired an algorithm called the ABC algorithm in computer science, where we do a similar approach to understand some of these complex things. I mean, that's pretty amazing to me. And scientists are also realizing that we can look at this culmination of individual behavior as well as the hive mind as a proxy for things like how our neurons and our brains might work. That's pretty amazing. Thanks for just doing better bees.